Hey everyone, Technomancer here with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix no service problem on your iPhone after iOS 26. So let's get started. First troubleshooting step, you're going to pull down that control menu or pull it up and put your phone on airplane mode briefly and then turn it off. And that does a quick network refresh. The next thing you're going to check out for is a carrier update. So in order to do that, you're going to go to settings, general, about, and wait on this page for about 10-15 seconds. If you have a carrier update available, it will pop up, say update carrier. If you don't, that's fine. Move on to the next troubleshooting step, which is going to be if you happen to have a one with a physical SIM card on your iPhone, for example, this one doesn't. I have another phone with a physical SIM I'll show you. You're going to take the SIM card out. Basically, take a SIM ejector tool or a paper clip, and then you're going to go ahead and look at the SIM tray which is going to have this little hole either left on the right side depending on the model you're going to take that and then go ahead and take the sim card out now once you take the sim card out if you happen to have a dual sim you're going to switch the slot it's going to be on the other side so you're going to take it out and then put it on the other side basically on the second tray so it's going to look like this for dual sim phone take it from the top to the bottom if you're in the back just move it to the top and then go ahead and reinsert it back in just like the same way and that should also help now if it's still not working the next thing you're going to go ahead and do is basically do this method you're going to quickly press and release volume up volume down and then hold down this side button until the screen goes completely black and the apple logo appears so i'll do volume up volume down and I hold on to this side button just like this you're going to wait for the phone to go completely black before you let go of that side button. So you're going to wait. And once it's Apple, we let go again, and that should go ahead and fix it for you. If it doesn't work the very first time, go ahead and try this method. This method will work. It will not delete any of your data. All I did was quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and I was holding down this big side button. So as you can see here, once the phone is back on, the next thing you're going to go ahead and do is go into your setting, go to general, and then look for BPN and device management. If you have a BPN, you need to turn it off and then delete it. So tap on BPN, delete it, and then see if it works. And if it works, you can always add it back in because BPN can sometimes block your service. Now, the next thing you want to do is in the settings, go to general scroll all the way down to transfer reset iphone click on reset and you're going to do what's known as a network setting reset a network setting reset will basically delete the network settings back to factory default however it will not delete any of your data so all of your data will still be on your phone now let's say you followed all this the final thing to do is in your setting make sure you're connected to wi-fi you go to general software update and check if there's an update out some as you can see here there if you had cellular issues seems to be a problem for some users on iOS 26 this is an update that fixes or look for the latest update and go ahead and update your phone and if all of this doesn't work just simply call your phone carry your company and have them take a look sometimes they have to reconfigure your service or do something on their end to make sure the service is working and I hope this video was helpful, so please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.